Well, here we are at Bob Basin again. And I'm all wired up for sound and got the other camera with me. And the tide's sort of coming in. And I'm hoping you're picking up everything I'm saying because I'm carrying a selfie stick at the same time. How cool is that? You'll get some views of the basin, but I'll be shooting it mainly on the other camera. I'm just going to back up to these signs so you can see what they say. There's one there. Hope you can read it. You can always stop the video to read it. Here's the species thing. Yeah. And if you look in the background of the shot, you should actually see the Trose steeple in the distance. Rumoured to be the highest steeple in any church in Scotland. So there you go. And there's a sign up there. It says Montrose Angling Club private water permits only. And across that side is the marshes for the wildfowlers to uh, go shooting things that fly. I've done it myself so I'm not being critical here. <laughs> Let's see if we can lift that over there. Okay. I'll go through the gate. There we go. I've got a wee platform here to stand on. And you can get a view of what I'm shooting. Now if the stick's wobbling about a bit, I do apologise. But I'm a block. Can't do two things at once, and I'm stopping doing everything because my camera's come up and said no memory card inside, which means that I've got to stop and have a look see. So you'll have to excuse me while I do that. We'll put this down over there and unplug the sound. Now you've got no sound except the music in the background and me on the computer doing a voiceover. I've just led the camera down and waved at it uh, in the longer or longish grass. It didn't get too long because they do bring cattle in here quite often and I've seen them grazing. The problem is when your camera says it needs a memory card you have to look. Now I'm just showing you. Look, I'm dancing for you as well, but I'm showing you that there actually is a memory card. I knew I'd put one in. Yeah, it's there. Yeah. <laughs> so the camera doesn't always get it right. It's not a cheap camera either, that one. Yeah, well, upwards and onwards. Well, here we are back again. The camera lied. It said it didn't have a memory stick card, and it did. 64 gigabyte. You think the camera would remember, wouldn't you? That is sad. I mean, that's really sad. <laughs> Who cares? <laughs> it's more than I can do. Anyway, you can see the sort of view I'm getting. I love that transitional effect, I copied it off NCIS where you get a load of single shots and a shutter sound showing you what's coming up. And this is with the tide almost out, not quite. But it was the swans that fascinated me, it's obviously swan mating season. Because these two went at it later on in the water and the one underneath must nearly, well, Drowned? 
the swans drown. <laughs> but it was quite amusing. Especially you can see them now, they're sort of billing and cooing just as that duck went past. He probably, the duck probably thought silly teenagers. <laughs> and there in the distance you can see Virgin Trains and the Montrose Church Spire, rumoured to be the tallest spire in Scotland. That's the East Coast Line there and Virgin Trains. Back with the swans again, and now you can see the tides in a lot more. You have to be patient shooting videos and sit around for a while. Especially when the tide takes about 12 hours to turn fully. And I don't usually do patience very well. There's them two swans again. You're saying which two, because like there's about 20 there. You'll see in a minute. Be patient. Patience is a virtue. As my old ma used to say. Hey, you are, look. I assume that's the guy on top. And he's just pushed her under the water saying you will give in. <laughs> but uh, it's not that deep, you can see. But yeah, I love that dance they're doing, the courtship ritual dance. Never caught it before and I think it's really sweet. Oh, the human race could get on like that, and I don't mean treadling in water. And I mean all the human race. <laughs> There's plenty swans, that's for sure. And that's that river that was all mud further back in the video. It doesn't take long to change. I love it. I love it up here. I love this side of the basin over on the Dunn side as I call it. Some lovely views. Always plenty wildlife. And that's your lot. Thanks for watching. This is the end. Honest. It is. It is. Honest. It is.